cosmetic passion here. So I'm going to be talking to you today about one of my favorite collection that just came out from MAC and it's called the Surf Baby Collection. Got a couple things from there but before I got to the store some of the stuff was already sold out. I was disappointed but I grabbed most of the stuff that I wanted. Okay, So I got three eyeshadows and one lipstick. I really wanted to get the blush but they were already sold out. So yes, so I'm going to show you the collections I got. And I got Sun Blonde. Okay, nice pretty yellow. Okay, almost a little close to my hair. <laughs> okay, then I got Short Shorts. Okay, it's a nice white with like a yellow pearl in it. Okay, and I got Surf in USA. Okay, these were the eyeshadows I got. I thought about getting saffron, but I kind of wish I did now because I've seen reviews on it and I really do like the color, but that's okay. I like this one the most and I really wish this was limited because this is like my favorite color now. Okay, and the lipstick I, call, I got is Naturally Incentric. Can we twist that up? Okay, it's basically the nude lips, as you can see. Mwah. Okay, but yes, I love their packaging. Very cute. It even has a little hibiscus flower. Okay, I even have my lipstick box. Okay, and as you can see, I got it from Macy's. Yay, Macy's. Okay, that's the lip bo lipstick box. And these are what the eyeshadow box looks like. Okay. So this one, Surfing USA, Back to Mac program. Yeah. They all look like that. So that's what I was able to pick up. So now I'm going to be showing you this look that I did with them using all the colors, and it kind of basically matches my hair. Okay, and I also have the lipstick on. So everything I'm using is from MAC Collection, except the eyeliner pencil. Okay, I'm using Mary Kay eyeliner. Okay, but everything else is from Mary K is from MAC. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to do that. So let's get started. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to apply a white cream base. You can use any cream base you prefer. So I'm going to apply this on my eye. I like to use white cream bases more than primer bases because I just think colors come out more awesomer. Okay, so go ahead and apply that on there. Take it all the way up to your eyebrow. Okay, don't forget to put that in your tear duct area. Swipe that down. Okay. Once you have that done, go ahead and get a flat brush right here. Nice flat thin one. Okay. Go ahead and get your sun blonde or any yellow you have. You can use Max. Sunny spot, um, basically any other yellow you have. Go ahead and apply that just like maybe one third of the eye. Go ahead and grab some more. Just put that on. Get that in that crease. Really love this blonde color. Has a yellow. Going to get some of that in the tear duct area right there. Now on the bottom, just apply it to where your eyelashes start. So probably one fourth of the way on the bottom. Okay, just like that. Kind of hard to tell right now next to the white, but once you add the other colors, it will surely pop. Okay, going to get another one that you have. You can either clean out that brush or use the other side, but I have another one. And I'm going to get that Surfing USA color. 
pat that on your brush. Pat it on the eyelid. Like I said, this is like my new favorite color. I just think it's so amazing. Okay, once you start getting closer to the yellow, and let me try and zoom in, I want you to just pat it in between just to blend the two together. Okay, you can also get very little of the inside the yellow and just swipe it towards the blue. Okay, that way you don't go too much blue into the yellow and then start decreasing on your yellow color. Okay, go and bring that on your crease. Pen it out. Using that same brush, you're going to use that tip part. Basically, tap it in there and apply it directly underneath your eyelashes. You may use an eyeliner brush to do this, but instead of using more brushes, I'm just going to use this. Fix that area right there. Okay, now go in and get a pencil brush or a small blending brush, whatever you have. Get that same blue, dab it in there. Make sure you highlight your crease really well so it really pops out. That's pretty good. Now again, once you get to that yellow, just fan it out. And then just basically tap on it, just so the blue doesn't become too dark. Get that little corner. Okay, just like that. Very fast and easy to do. Okay, last but not least, go ahead and get another flat brush you have and get your short shorts. This looks really great with the Sun Blonde because it has those like golden color sparkles and pearls in it. I'm going to use that as my highlighter under my brow. Why I'm using a bigger brush is because when you pat it on there, part of the brush is going to hit that blue and it's going to fade it out right there. Okay, so as you can see right there, it's fading out slowly. Okay, I'm going to grab some more. Now you're going to bring that down here just a little bit. just like that. Now just grab a little bit more on your brush and we'll swipe it right there. Right there in the corner. So it's like blue, yellow, white. Yellow, blue. Okay, just like that. Perfect. Okay, now that you have that done, go and get your eyeliner. and apply that on your waterline. Okay, voila. Now using your lipstick, Naturally Eccentric, go and take that, apply it directly to your lip. If you want, you can add a nice gloss to it, but I like to keep it matte. I think it really makes it pop out and everything. Okay, just like that. And there you go. You have that look. Pretty awesome, huh? One of my favorite colors. I like to wear this look a lot now in the summer, especially since I have this hair. 
and one of my favorites. Really love it, and it makes my eyes pretty pop, I think. Okay, very hello ish. Okay, now since to basically sharpen up your edges, you can do this if you want, but this is what I like to do. When I work with shimmer colors, I like to get my foundation that I use. I use a cream foundation. As you can tell, my foundation's already on. You can check out that video that I have up to see how I put it on. But I'm just going to get a little bit more and apply it directly under my cheeks, okay? Just like that. And just pat it out. Why I like to do that is when you use bigger brushes and if you're not as careful, you start to get those little shimmer powders everywhere. Okay? Next thing you know, you have like shimmers all down your cheek area. Okay? Now, since I didn't get the cheek blush from the collection, I'm just going to be using a darker bronzing. This is from Mary Kay. Just going to use a little bronzing right there. Then I'm going to get a nice big angle fluffy brush. Tap that into the lid. Swirl that out. Make sure you don't poof yourself, okay? You can either smile, that jawline right there, or you can make the fish. Okay, whichever you like to do, just go and buff that area. Okay, really defines those cheek areas, as you guys can see. Okay, very well. And voila, that's how I'm going to complete this look. Hope you all like it. Go ahead and check out the review for my Surf Baby collection. Okay, go and find that video and you can check that out. Just see my opinions on it. Hope you guys comment, rate, and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up, five stars, if you like this. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye!